Assalamu alaikum. Hello friends, how are you? <coughs> Welcome to tutorial.com and today we will discuss about how to browse a website uh, using Excel VBA or using user form. The purpose of starting the video or tutorial video, uh, guys, please subscribe my channel if you are new in the uh, in my channel. So click on the subscribe button and obviously for the notification, upcoming notification, click on the bell icon. So guys, let's start about the video of tutorial, uh, how to uh, browse channels uh, or websites using the user form. And in my next video, I will discuss about how to log in and uh, attach file in the uh, website using user form. So in today's step, we'll start using the user form. Here is a sheet, Excel sheet. Uh, there's nothing to do here in the Excel sheet. Here is a user form, Excel Visual Chat Browser and URL. I mean to say about websites. So let's see how it works. The right here is YouTube.com. If I click on the Mozilla Firefox, automatically browsing YouTube using user, um, Mozilla Firefox and if I click on Google Chrome starting uh, browsing on Google Chrome on uh, YouTube if I change the URL or uh, website as uh, google.com and click on the Firefox. Let's create an, uh, another one tab and starting uh, finding the Google Chrome and uh, Google.com. So click on the Google Chrome browser. Also start a new tab in the Google Chrome browser and find the Google.com website. As you can uh, write any kinds of website there, or uh, xyz.com to find softwares, or uh, click on the uh, Mozilla Firefox to find the website of xyz. As usual, click on the Google Chrome browser, select another tab find the website of XYZ. Now I'm going to close this and as we exit it, I'll close the Google uh, Mozilla Firefox browser. Now let's see how it works or what kind of codes I have used to do this, to get this web uh, user form. So guys, first of all, we will create the exit button, as usual, unload uh, user form 3, it's user form 3, so I am using unload user form 3, it's working, now for the coding for Mozilla Firefox and Google Chrome, first of all, double click on the Mozilla Firefox, write out the codes here so first of all we'll uh, select select some variables there i'm copying pasting this 
so then str is string str is text box one as a text box text box one text box one is a uh, uh, stringly work for the uh, opening the website then url as string and url is equal to text box one now we are going to create a path there that uh, from where the, uh, the user from find out the browser so the path firefox as a string and the path firefox is equal to c uh, program firefox mozilla firefox that's the, the address of my computer where the firefox path is uh, available if there uh, firefox is equal to uh, clear zero or empty then fire uh, firefox see firefox is said uh, if dear firefox uh, firefox is equal to zero then what we'll do is a condition there of if then it will uh, create a message box there and message box will say firefox path not found if your path is wrong firefox path is wrong then it will uh, message you firefox path is not found with the, uh, with the critical micro ending exit sub it will end the sub if, you, if it uh, can find the path of firefox then at the end of the coding we will write there cell uh, double inverted comma again double inverted comma and firefox and double inverted comma and the inverted comma new tab and url website that will, uh, will create always a new tab when you click on the uh, firefox button if it is the same uh, website it will create a another one uh, website there another one tab there as an example if i create uh, click on fb.com there Click on the Mozilla Firefox. It's opening the fb.com page. If I click on again on the Mozilla Firefox, it will create an another one tab for the fb. It's the first tab, it's the second tab. Or if I didn't click any, didn't write any website there, or click on the Mozilla Firefox, it will open another one Mozilla Firefox. There is no website are available. again exiting now let's see about the google chrome button uh, approximately it's similar with google chrome uh, mozilla firefox but little bit different is the same in mozilla firefox we are writing the r google chrome uh, uh, coding <coughs> the mystery str is string str is text box one the visual is a string and this one is, uh, is equal to text box one dot text a little bit different with, uh, between firefox button common button one dim chrome path a string chrome path is equal to c this is where my uh, google chrome is available in my computer if dr uh, chrome path is equal to empty then Chrome path, uh, this file where the file is available is wrong. If there Chrome path is equal to empty, then if, uh, if condition should say message box, Chrome path not found, BB critical, macro ending, then exit sub. As usual, right here for the new tab, shell empty, then Chrome path and uh, empty and Chrome path uh, new tab. And you are a BB height. Okay, guys, let's see again the yahoo.com. Okay, I'm gonna write here yahoo.com. If I click on the Mozilla Firefox, it's not finding yahoo.com. That means I write a wrong website there. Yahoo.com is not getting google.com
that means in the yahoo.com the spellings are right but the yahoo something problem in yahoo that's not in the problem of this uh, user form click on the google chrome or you can write here mpestn.com click on google chrome so open in the amazon.com website now click on the mozilla firefox yes, no, I fail to connect with mozilla firefox that means yahoo could be open in google chrome maybe yahoo.com click on the google.com that's open okay that's not the problem of the website of yahoo that's a problem of mozilla firefox but the, not the problem of this user form okay next i will discuss about how to log in in the website to write automatically as uh, i'm uh, yahoo mail.com okay yahoo yahoo mail.com yahoo mail.com yeah google chrome it's already signed in i'm already signed in the yahoo.com so look at this fp.com fp.com click on the mozilla firefox there is no email address and no password so in the next video we will discuss about how to automatically log in in the website selected website or similar website so guys thanks for watching this video also thanks for staying with us if you are not if you did uh, subscribe my channel so please feel free to subscribe my channel and obviously 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 click on the bell icon to get all the notification for upcoming interesting video or learning video so guys allah peace